Hello friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today I am going to share with you my experience of traveling in Emirates business class from Dubai to Pakistan. I am sure it's going to be an exciting vlog so please do stay with me till end of this video. I am here at Dubai Airport Terminal 3 which is dedicated for Emirates Airlines. I am at business class check-in counters. The whole process was very quick because there was no other passenger in the queue. You get kind of red carpet treatment but in blue colors. I have received a travel hygiene kit on the way which I will open and show you in a while after reaching a lounge. So basically my flight is an early morning flight at 6 am. Uh, I reached much earlier at the airport thinking that during pandemic there would be crowd and might take some time but really I have never seen such views at Dubai airport. This used to be a really crowded place with lots of people, lots of connected flights, passengers, which wasn't the case during the pandemic. I have checked in early and now I came to know that my flight is two hours late. So I'll be spending time in the lounge. There are options of business class lounge if you are a business class passenger or you can also use Marhaba lounge which is not bad either. You have option of free access to Marhaba lounge on various credit cards. So let's quickly see what we have in travel hygiene kit. There are a couple of face masks which has become part of our life during past two years. You have some hand sanitizers, some wet wipes and gloves. But these lounge access of course include complimentary meals. Since I was there for three hours, I did spend some time trying different varieties to kill time. So finally after spending the whole night at airport, I am at the boarding gate. The initial flight time was 6 am and the revised time now would be 9 am. It was 3 hours flight delay. I was there a lot earlier than the usual so it's like 6 hours spent at the airport. My seat number is 1A, which is the first seat right behind the pilot. And you can see this beautiful interior. Emirates Airlines is one of the best airlines in the world for some reason. Look at this huge leg room. Even if I stretch my legs, it's still good enough space can easily lay down full stretched and have a really nice nap throughout the flight. Flight delays are the most painful part of any travel but once the plane starts moving it's a really comfortable feeling that you're finally leaving for your destination. Our pilot was very generous. I was like pissed off with the delay and he was allowing different planes to pass through. This was the third one. But luckily it was our turn and we have started to move now.
it's a three hours flight good enough time to lay down and relax especially after spending a long night waiting at the airport and Emirates business class to provide a really comfortable experience you also have these tablets to watch your favorite movies and TV programs I usually watch Top Gear the best reality show about cars in business class you will also receive a menu to select your meal unlike economy where you only have fixed options and this menu looks good it have lots of options especially for alcohol lovers I will skip this part and show you the menu of breakfast chicken fry and the takatak cheese omelet I'll go for the first one so it's chicken fry with little gravy chickpeas and the sweets semolina sweets uh, served with croissant some parathas jam butter the usual stuff also so after half of the flight we have covered the gulf of oman and we are flying over gawadar region it's one of the new travel destinations in pakistan Pakistan is one of the most blessed countries in the world in terms of its geography starting from sea connected with Karachi you have desert in Sindh you have lots of agriculture land in Punjab you have northern areas full of high peak mountain ranges rivers glaciers snow sand I mean all kind of weathers and especially in December end of December and January the weather is very foggy in Punjab the flight got delayed for that specific reason it's noon time but you can see there is this dense fog So friends we have landed safely at Allama Iqbal International Airport which marks the end of this video. I hope you like my experience. Please do let me know in comments and do subscribe to our channel for lots of exciting videos to come. Until next video, goodbye.